Happy Friday! I'm in a great mood. I woke up a little early this morning. Lately, I've been editing the vlogs like in the morning when I wake up. I don't know if I'll keep doing that this weekend, but I've been doing it during the weekdays and it's been a really nice way of waking up. I wake up, I import the footage, and as it's importing, I read my book. And I'm still reading in the holidays. It's so cute. It's like a really, really, really cute book. Yeah, so today's December 2nd, Vlogmas Day 3. And um, this morning, I'm teaching at Stride. I'm teaching 9.30 Spin with Kristen. I normally just teach Monday nights at 5.30 p.m. But I wanted to teach a Friday morning. I haven't done it in so long. So I texted Kristen. I was like, can I crash your 9.30? And she was like, of course. So I'm teaching with her and I'm very excited. And then after that, I'm going to stay at the studio for a bit and decorate the studio for Christmas. So I have to actually load my car up. Why did that look better last night? I have to load my car up with all of the Christmas decorations. And I don't know why my brain wasn't like working last night, but I was like, oh, I'm just gonna have my boyfriend like load them up while I am at the comedy show with Jules. Oh my God, why is this not working? Well, I drove to the comedy show, so I don't know how I, like, what is going on? Whatever. I don't know why I thought that he would load stuff into my car when I had my car, but whatever. Anyway, um, but yeah, so then we're gonna decorate and then I'm gonna run some errands and then I have therapy later today. And then I think tonight we're, my boyfriend and I are gonna drive around, get Chick-fil-A and look at Christmas shows. Christmas lights. We went out to dinner last Friday and like, when we got back home, we were like, why did we do that? Like, we're just such homebodies. Like, we would just so much, oh my God, my skin is like so dry. I should have put moisturizer on first. We would just so much rather just like stay home <laughs> and like hang out with each other than like go out do anything else outside of the house because that feels so much better so yeah that's the day it's a little hectic right now because i have to leave in 10 minutes and i have to load my car with the decorations i have to leave a key out front for the cleaners and i need to get myself ready all at the same time, so I will see you guys in a minute. Guys, Chris. Where are my shoes? I put them down there. Yeah, I don't have, we don't have a bike. I don't even think we have music. Did you put music on? I did. Oh, okay. So that's good. That's good. <laughs> guys, me and Kristen are literally out here saying how tired we are that we should just do a 45 minute meditation and spin instead of teaching it. And I think that's such a good idea. I think it's perfect. <laughs> I agree. 100%. We're saying we're gonna do a freestyle class. They can just do what they want, it'll be great. No big deal. We'll just put on the 45 minute playlist. They do their thing and we just go take a nap. <laughs> we take a nap. <laughs> I was gonna order um, Sweet Aloha, uh, but I think I'm just gonna go to Dunkin' actually and oh, get a so bacon, egg, should. and cheese. <sighs> what? Get to go. Well, okay, Dunkin' is literally $3. If I were to DoorDash Sweet Aloha, it's literally gonna be 20 bucks. Let's just do Dunkin'. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Yeah, I'm down with that. I need it. I have all the decorations in my car. Hi. Getting my life together. There is someone who is not new to stride but new to spin on bike 10. Could someone help her set up the bike? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, thanks. And then Alexis is celebrating her birthday today, yes. so I'll bring in the cupcake at, like, at the, the last one. At the one. end. Yeah, Thank that'd be great. You. Thank you. You're the best. Thank you. You're welcome. You like frozen, right? You're right. So funny, I was literally said to her this morning, I'm like, okay, do you want to wear your sneakers or like what shoes do you want to wear? She's like, pretty boots. So like I thought she meant like her little ankle boots. I'm like, yeah, no big deal. Let's go get these little ankle boots. She was freaking out like, no, that's not what she wanted. She wanted her cowboy boots. Oh, good for her. So I said, you know what? Gee, you do you with your cowboy boots at three years old. Good for her. It's never too early for cowboy boots. Never. <laughs> never too early in the day. Never too young to start. Never too early in life. Literally good for her. I know. I said, Miss Tori will like your cowboy boots today. She's a girl that knows what she wants. Oh my god, I need so much stuff. I have to go get ready. Hi. Say hi, YouTube. Hi, YouTube. Wait, your mom doesn't know we're filming this. So say hi, mom. Hi, mom. <laughs> 
thinks she's gonna be so shocked when she watches it. No, wrong thing. <laughs> Say, tell everyone what your name is. All right, thank you, Jess. Thank you, have a good one. Oh, now she's gonna know. Bye, guys. Jess, I was gonna surprise you with Olivia in my vlog. Oh, yay! So that when you watch it, Olivia's there and she's saying hi, Mom. Oh my goodness, are you gonna, are we gonna put it on the TV? Yeah. You're gonna be on the movie star. Movie star. <laughs> she loves that. You're gonna be a movie star, Liv. Yeah. All right. You have a crack me. That's <laughs> so funny. I was actually like on TikTok and I talked about. Wait, why do we have all like boys? <laughs> Wait, you saw my TikTok? Oh. <laughs> well, I don't go on it a lot, but like, what I used there, what I recently signed up for, it, there was like, you know, all these behind the scenes, and all these, and I shoot. Don't spend a lot of time on it, but. Oh, I don't know when or where. Thanks, Liz. What a good job, Abel. Liz, remember when we got ramen? Yeah. Wasn't that fun? Oh we need to get lunch again. Anytime you want. I love lunch. Oh, oh, baby. Got it? Okay. Oh my god, Gwen, you are just like the cutest little thing spreading your stuff in your bed. Okay, yeah. so now that we have those things behind the desk, I don't know where we want to put these two. I love that, Gwenny. Be careful, please. No, we only had one that was behind the desk right there. I never. Please. Okay, so there's two back there. There was one right here. One here, so that's for the three bathrooms. And then we have one right here. Okay, so then where do we have that? Oh. Oh, that's cute. Did we have that last year? Does that look okay? Yeah, because it's like, set, I mean, it's off centered, but it works because of the tree. Uh oh. It's okay. there, you know what it's there from? I'm sorry, I'm so sweaty. Oh, from the balloon tower, right? Yeah. I'm going. Yep. Here's my thighs. There you go. There you go. Okay, put it on the top. Can you reach? Turn it over. Good job. Yay, Liz. Yay. Yay. Good. Yeah. Oh, guys, it looks so cute. I'm really surprised that she doesn't have her own army. Okay. I asked Aaron if I could make one, and he said I was being ridiculous. No, you're not being ridiculous. I said, well, I'll talk to Auntie Tori about how to get that. Cutest little. Go put it in there. Just stick it in there. I have my list of contact to talk about, but now it's just a matter of getting the bravery to put myself in front of I really think you should do. Well, you don't have to be in front of the camera, but I think a podcast for you would just be like amazing. Just stick it in there, Jane. Thank you. I can hear you. Here, why don't you guys do it together? I'll help you. Dust it off. Okay. Good job, ladies. Teamwork. Yay! That's it. Funny, they look amazing. High five. High five, girls. Yay! Hey, Jess, you want me to clean up around? Yeah, wait, here. I have another one. All right, let's see what do we need to do. So it's 12.30. I have a couple errands to run. I have therapy at three, so I think I'm just gonna run errands for the next few hours. This is what I love doing, is sending screenshots of my planner to me for my day, so I can just see what I have to do. So, oh, I need to post that. Okay, so I did that. I love having my to-do list with me. All right, so check, check, check. All right, errands. I need to go to the post office. Bank, GW, UPS store. Okay, so I think I'm gonna go to GW first because that's the thing that's farthest away. And it makes the most sense to do that now. And then I can hit up the boring stuff later. Trip, my favorite, you know, Virgin Islands. It's not like new for you, but okay. Oh, it has to be new? Wait, I just had this epiphany that like I have to talk about. And I probably just sound stupid saying it, but so I listen to the toast every day and I find myself talking like them thinking in my head like oh I like I wonder what they're gonna say about this tomorrow I even find myself being influenced about like shows and what they say about shows are as if they're my own original thoughts like what I'm getting at is I listen to them so much that I start to think and talk and emulate their behavior so I just was thinking this as I'm driving and I'm also thinking like 
I should really just always listen to a self-help podcast. Like if I listen to a Jay Shetty podcast every single day or a Huberman Labs podcast every single day, like I think my life would really change for the better. You know what I mean? Like I really think it would. So maybe I should start that. Not today. Well, not right now. I want to finish this episode. But after this, I think I should replace my daily toast episode with like a daily mindset mentor kind of podcast the way my life would just transform transform I think would be like really huge and I know this is not an original thought but it's original to me like the epiphany just hit me I'm so tired I'm so tired all right it's now 2 30 I did um two of the errands that I needed to do so that makes me happy um I have therapy in 30 minutes and um, I think I'm just gonna stop at Wawa. I need to get gas and I think I'm just gonna grab like a drink and a snack while I'm in there. Maybe just like an iced tea or something. You know what, I should put this stuff. So tired. I can't wait to just like go home and take a nap later tonight. It's like all I wanna do is take a nap. I kind of also want to go out to dinner. Um, there's this new restaurant that just opened up and I really love it. Um, it's like a chain, but it's like a farm, it's a local chain. It's a local farm to table chain. And um, I really just want to go to dinner. The other thing that's hard is um, I never know what time my boyfriend gets off work because he works. I always get the two mixed up blue collar versus white collar like what is what I always forget but he works in um, like construction so what is that blue collar white collar I don't I don't know let me know but yeah so he um, goes to like a different job site each day so and we never like really know what time he's gonna be done work so like last night he got back home at like 9 p.m. And the morning and the day before he got back at like 6 p.m. And then the day before it was like 5 p.m. And then the day before that it's like 7 p.m. So like I never really know. So I can't like make a reservation. Um, and sometimes he's like really tired after work. So I also don't want to make reservations. But I would love to like go to dinner and then drive around and look at Christmas lights tonight. But we'll see. Sorry, this has been like a very car vlog today. But... This is what you get some days. This is just what Vlogmas is some days. Love therapy. I just feel so much better. And today I just like literally, <laughs> I found out today that my therapist chairs recline. I did not know that. So I literally kicked off my shoes and I reclined and we just like had girl talk and just like shot the shit and like, God, I just freaking love my therapist, which is awesome. I always feel so much better. And it wasn't that I was in a bad mood because I really wasn't. I, I had a really great day. I just got very tired. And so as soon as I went into her office, I was eating candy, as you guys saw, chilling, like chilling hard off, oh, frick. Chilling hard. And then we just had girl talk, but yeah. Now it's four, but it feels way later. And the only thing I want to do is watch some Housewives. Um, I have two more errands that I'm just gonna, I think, run tomorrow. And, oh, you know what's so crazy is I passed by my old elementary school today and I saw the same crossing guard from when I was in kindergarten. That's 20 years ago since I was in kindergarten. And it's the same crossing guard. It was so cute. He made me want to be a crossing guard. I remember when I was in kindergarten and they said, what do you want to be when you grow up? I said a crossing guard because of him and he's still working there. Therapy rocks and once you find the right therapist, it is so transformative to your life and it should leave you feeling better than when he walked in. Oh, I can't even tell you how good it is to be home. I'm so dramatic. I literally leave my house for one day. 
was from like nine to four and I'm like, it's so good to be home. And I had the cleaners come today, so it's like I come home to a clean house. Oh my God. I'm gonna make a snack plate. I'm gonna have peanut butter and jelly and cheese and crackers. The cheese that I have is Parmesan and I have hot pepper jelly and triscuits. So we will do what we can. And I'm gonna watch Housewives. It's the best and I'm gonna take a nap. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Like the way I'm so tired. It's honestly Claudia Oshre's fault because I don't stay up late. And then I go to her comedy. Oh wait, what time is it? Oh, Jules is going into the hospital at 5.30. I need to text her. I'm not caught up on Beverly Hills, but I don't know if I want to watch, or sorry, Salt Lake City. I don't know if I want to watch Salt Lake or Old Jersey. Old Jersey like really just hits so different. What's better than a peanut butter and jelly? Nothing. This is so amazing. I mean, are you kidding me? I go there. And then you have Margaret and Danielle turning on me and then whispering in Melissa and Teresa's ear the whole time. I'm so tired, but I can't take a nap. When you want to take the nap, but the nap won't take you. Like, that's just where I'm at. I'm going to DoorDash. I guess this is Grubhub. Some Italian food. I should honestly just go pick it up. Hi, can I place an order for pickup, please? Um, can I have spaghetti with pesto sauce? Can I have penne with blush sauce? Okay. Um, can I have a small cheese pizza? Okay. And can I have, um, tomato, uh, caprese, please? Okay. And that's all. Number 34, I'll see you in 20 minutes. Thank you. Yeah. Bye. Delivery services are great, except the fees like the fees like what was going to be like fifty dollars with all the fees became like 75. my rationale though with like instacart stuff like that is like i feel like i'm helping the economy i feel like i'm creating jobs you know like i like that someone can make either a full-time living or a side hustle some extra money from doing instacart it gives them a job, some money. I feel like I'm helping the economy. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go pick that up in 20 minutes. We heard the lady. So, I went to a local Italian place that I love. I went to go pick up the food and it was so cute. Like, all these people were eating. Everyone was wearing a Christmas sweater in there. I'm like, what in the Hallmark? It was just like really adorable. So I got caprese salad and pesto for me. Pesto with spaghetti. This pesto is very good. Then I also got a small cheese pizza. Mmm. So good. All right, I think I'm just gonna end the vlog here for the night because considering that it's eight, I don't think anything very eventful is going to happen. But I will talk to you guys tomorrow morning. Thank you for following me along today and for watching Vlogmas. It's been really fun so far. And yeah, love you guys. See you tomorrow.